Carro. Hello, my Pisces friends. It's Gabby Halo. This is going to be an energy reading 24th, 25th, 26th, 27th. I've not been doing these readings per sign very much. I've needed some time. And I'm not sure I'll do them frequently, but this could resonate all the way into the end of the first week of May. So let's get some angel guidance cards for you, my Pisces friends. Timing is fluid, as all the readers do say, it's because nothing in the angelic world is linear. All right, so what do we have going on here from my Pisces fringe angel messages, please? Schooling, study, and education help your life purpose and personal growth at this time. The angels will guide you and help you with this process. So, you might be studying something online, thinking about going to school online, since schools are, you know, doing their thing. Maybe they're all going to be going back probably September, but you might feel it's better for you to try it online, so that you can keep up doing more than one thing. You have a gift for working with young people. And your divine purpose involves helping, teaching, or parenting children. I would even take this further as to being an example for children of all ages. Let's remember that I myself, as well, am someone's child, even though I'm a full-grown person. So, perhaps this is also about helping people deal with their inner child. That could be... Look at that. The Wheel of Fortune spins. Divine timings definitely evolved here. And there's an opportunity to work and to study at the same time. It's almost like an apprenticeship type program, which you really would like to do, I'm understanding. But you're going back to school in September or whenever it is you're going back to school and you feel that it will interfere. But what about taking school online as opposed to going back to regulated school for it so that you could do both what about that well you have the discipline it seems to me this person's got the discipline we have nurturing something growing something spending time nurturing something and growing it buckling down getting the work done you feel like there's been a pause in action here Temporary pause in action, unnecessary worry. Is this because schools were held off and you went now to having to do something else while schools were closed, basically? So you're not sure how all of this is going to work itself out, but it's all about divine timing. And it seems to me there's a beautiful offer that's going to come your way. Yes, there is. Oh, look at that. It's going to require a decision. Four of Swords, this person returning from battle, resting, taking some time to rest, using the sword that you have used to wield all of your life journeys thus far. And the Divine steps in and says, you go ahead and rest. We see the battle you have fought and we are making a decision. The Divine is blowing their trumpet. Something coming back around. A thought that you had had previously about how to do whatever this schooling thing is is going to come to you again while you are meditating or resting. A new way of doing something. What is this judgment card about with the Wheel of Fortune? It's almost like karma. Karma is stepping into play here. There's something about karma coming for you as a schooling part of your life purpose right now. Oh my, 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 dang, look at that. The Ace of Wands, they've seen everything you've done and they are going to hand you a huge opportunity. The Divine is handing you an opportunity saying, trust, go ahead and rest, take the time you need. Do what's going on, because when this rest is over, they are going to blow the trumpet, and you are going to be called, my friends. That's beautiful. 
called into a brand new passionate offer and it's something you know how to do already this wand already has growth on it it's something you have got the skills for everything you've learned so far in school and that sort of thing you might feel like you need to go to school more but you can do both at the same time the divine's got you here this is beautiful what's the central energy surrounding all of this the central energy for my pisces friends Look at that. An opportunity, an emotional opportunity being brought to you that's going to surprise you. This could be new love coming your way as well, I might add. New love, something that's going to surprise you, huh? All right, let's find out more. Someone coming to you to tell you something that surprises you and makes you emotionally happy could be something to do with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio child. Taking a leap of faith. This new love or this, this communication coming in that makes you emotional, that's going to surprise you, is going to require you to take a leap of faith. Yep, it is. People might think you're crazy, but man, you want to do it. Could be with a Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. Perhaps it's about how you make your money. Taking a leap of faith to change that. Possibly the working with children thing. Look at that. A very happy outcome ensues. How beautiful. The happiest card in the deck. Sitting on the entrepreneur, the wifey material person, taking the leap of faith. I wonder if this is you guys trying to build some something beautiful, taking that leap of faith towards this happy outcome. And look at that. The independence card. Having independence financially. Reuniting with what independence financially means. Cause for celebration. Absolutely beautiful. Nine of Pentacles. Man, look at that. Eight of Pentacles to the Seven of Pentacles. The Divine has brought something along and saying, hurry up and wait. And now, all of a sudden, we're getting the whiffs of it's going to be go time soon. conflicted there has been an absolute battle there is going to be celebration but there's been an absolute battle i think that someone might be reuniting with someone from their past and it's got something to do with you something that they've settled regarding the children and you might be very conflicted and part of it's because i think someone might not be single for long Someone might have to come out of being single or want to when this good stuff happens. There's communication you want to give to somebody about the good stuff in your life. And it's entirely possible you may be wanting to reunite with somebody, but it means coming out of being single. Been an absolute battle to get to this point for you. A spiritual growth of everything and there's still some confusion many options well what if they have more options what if i'm not the option what if what if what if this is my i'm gonna what if the divine to absolute death okay because because i'm comfortable with that for now <laughs> until you're not anymore and you decide to have you know go at somebody with a knight of swords <laughs> What the heck's taking you so long? I've been waiting forever. Get off your duff. Let's get a move on it. It's like the divine is sending a messenger to say, come on, you can do this. You can do this. Yeah, you can. Ten of cups, hey? Happy husband, happy wife, happy family, happy life. So that's what you're headed for. When this happens for you and you decide to let go of being single and you head to whatever this is that you're happy and makes you emotionally fulfilled, something to do with children working with children all of this is going to lead right to this for you my pisces people how beautiful is that for y'all about time huh happy pisces people i like the sound of that mm -hmm. let's get some goddess deck cards for you life restored spiritual resurrection is gifted to you now Whatever part of your life you thought to be dead is being revived and will flourish back into life. Just as the phoenix rises from the fire, transitioning from death into life, so too will you rise again, healed and renewed. How beautiful. 
I like the sound of that for my Pisces friends. I know quite a few of you have struggled, 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 and it's been hard, hard times for you to feel much of anything. And I, I love the sound of this, life restored. I'm so happy for my Pisces friends. Beautiful. Serpent of Fire, do not assess your current ability based on past standards, leaving the past in the past. As they no longer apply to you, you are stronger and more powerful than you know than you have ever been before. You need to learn afresh what you are capable of, and Isis helps you now. High Priestess. A mystery is to be unveiled. A new clarity around your direction is unfolding. Be willing to wait for the full reveal, but also recognize what is happening at this time. You will be gaining valuable insight into where you are being led and for what purpose. Wow, look at that. See, it's not even about you knowing it all up front. It's about the divine having you, bringing about this beauty, this happy, and what it is you want to create financially for yourself. Taking the leap forward which brings about emotional change. Absolutely beautiful. My Pisces friends, I hope this resonates for you. I love you guys. I'll talk to you again soon. Blessings.